I wanted to do a review on these sunglasses that I got on Amazon. Um, the brand is called Les Specs. You can see right there. This is um, a company that was founded in Australia in 1979. It's a good year to be born actually because that's when I was born. So on Amazon, I got these for $59. $59.95, which um, I don't know if it, which I think for me is a good value because if you look, the plastic is, um, it's thick. It's not like thin, not flimsy, and they are um, very comfortable. So like when I put it on, yay. Um, it does have the over, what is it? Oh, the oversized look. So if you're looking for the, the really round oversized, I do recommend these glasses. They are very comfortable. They don't put pressure on your head right here if it's too tight or it doesn't, what is it? It doesn't um, put pressure on your bridge. I don't know if it's because of the design right here. If you look at it, it's pretty cool, different. And, um, so the reason why I got these glasses is because I love Audrey Hepburn, which you should already know. And um, I was looking for glasses to kind of match the glasses she had in the movie in Breakfast at Tiffany's. I mean, obviously the Breakfast at Tiffany's glasses were the, um, who made those? Oliver Goldsmith, and they're like $400. So I can't afford that one. If I could, I would. I don't know, maybe. Then I wouldn't have found these, right? Um, so to me, these were like the closest that looked like those glasses because the color, like the color of the frame, like this is called, what is this called? Um, streaky tortoise, because it looks like a tortoise shell. And then um, the lens in the movie, I know her lenses weren't as dark as these, but, um, but I still like these. And um, I, would recommend these glasses. They're very lightweight and they don't fall. You know, some glasses, when you put them on, you put your head down, your glasses fall. These actually stay, so I'll show you. See, they didn't move. Um, what else was cool? Oh, this, they come in this really good, or really cool um, holder. It has like a little pocket so you could put like your cell phone if you wanted to, or even some lipstick just to hold it and the op the way it, it opens is this way which i thought was cool the pouch that's what i was trying to say the pouch so it opens like this what that is cool and it's not like you know the hard cases where it takes up a lot of space so it's literally just the glasses and at the beach too put your glasses well at the beach you would wear your sunglasses right all right but there you go perfect pocket or in the pocket you can put a little glass cleaner inside. Is that cool? What? <laughs> so what do you think? Would you buy these? Would I buy them again? I would. Would I buy another um, glass style from the same company? Yes, I totally would. I think next time I'll go for the more. Maybe a little more cat eye. I don't know, still thinking about it, but I'd love these at the moment because I'm always on the hunt for glasses because I like them. Oh, you know what the name of these glasses are called? Um, Jealous Game. And it says right there. I don't know if you can see it right there. Jealous Game. So maybe if you're like spying on somebody incognito, can't really tell. But I like them. So if you like buggy eye, oversized, these are totally for you. So yeah. You should try them out. They are so cool. <laughs> Let's see. What else? Yeah. Comfortable. I've had them for a month now. And um, these are by far my favorite. I've gotten other ones where they're like, ah, too much pressure. Too much pressure on the head. So these are comfortable. And um, if you want to give it a try, you can totally buy these on Amazon. I put a link below. So... You can totally get your own. <laughs> All right, so that's it. That is my review on the Lespex glasses or the Lespex sunglasses in the um, 
jealous game the color is streaky tortoise they are they are the over size look and i think they are pretty wonderful okay i winked and you couldn't see it because i had sunglasses on but hey i hope you have a great day comment below if you want to if you don't it's okay too okay bye